being online and having digital communication is not a choice anymore. There's been a massive rise in fraud and scam and spam calls. We block close to 38.1 billion calls globally. The True Cyber Safe campaign, which we are doing in partnership with True Callers, focuses on making you resilient, making you aware about different kinds of patterns of cyber crimes and then how to prevent from these crimes, where to report. We launched this program sometime in the last week of February. We did this with the representatives of METI, the Home Ministry, along with representation from Assam Police. That you have trained the 1,500,000 uh, cyber volunteers that will take the program across the country. All the best from my side and uh, in whatever capacity, in whether personal or official, I am willing to participate. In this particular training with True Caller and uh, Cyber Peace Foundation, we are putting out all the thoughts, the processes and the steps that people can take to be cyber safe. Our collaboration with the government has been very significant because they continue to share the modus operandi of various scams and frauds that are taking place. And they play a very crucial role because then what we do is we borrow that knowledge from them and we go out and include that in our curriculum. Hoshari is in this way that we are increasing our knowledge. For your safety and security, we are entering into a new partnership with True Caller and Cyber Peace Foundation to combat the growing menace of uh, cyber threat. In Tamil Nadu, we had a you know massive uptake. We had 10,000 people who attended just one training. We also had RUSA, which is the government institute there, which actually sent us a letter of appreciation because of the kind of training and the work we did. You know, today, they call bank wala ban ke phone karte. If the real bank will call, it will be verified with green color. And that call you can take away without being scared. In many colleges, many young students have interacted with them. If you talk to the students, they don't know about how to secure their digital identities, how vulnerable they are, what are the breaches, what are the threats they are facing. How many of you girls have been a recipient of random or known or unknown obscene messages in your DMs and inboxes? And that answers the need of the hour. Women's safety is a very important agenda for us. We have about 235 million users now in India um, and half of them are women. We of course are doing whatever we can on product, you know, through the True Caller app, pinning the, the national emergency helpline number for women on our quick dial. We have segregated a bar called emergency numbers. Can you see that? You can directly dial an emergency number from True Caller. It was very amazing, very amazing, even though we are uh, active online nowadays, but we do not know how to protect ourselves. First time I ever got the clear concept of what cyber crime is and what cyber safety is, how I can protect my data and myself. Sir has literally shown how many people have checked your account. I am using Truecaller for a while, how they identify the fraud, it really helps me. From the bank also it tells you that it is a verified account or the person's name, so I can think before picking up the call. As a part of the program, we are doing Nukkar Nataks, we are doing awareness programs, there are activities that are happening on the social media. It's not just young people across colleges, we are also reaching out to senior citizens, we are reaching out to working women. We have a lot of learning from here. Two callers need to set up in the mobile. And the fraud call will be on the red. There is a lot of money. 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 So this is an amalgamation of all. True caller is the right tool for your device to protect you from these scammers and callers. The government machinery is there to support you to this initiative. Cyber Peace and True Caller are taking that leverage to reach out to the right audience. Till now, we've been able to take this campaign to about 16 lakh people in about five regions of the country, both through in-person trainings and also through the virtual mode. And we're just getting started. We are very excited to engage with many more state governments. Of course, continue our work with the Ministry of Home at the central uh, level and also the Department of Consumer Affairs and METI but also go much deeper into districts, into states, into villages to talk about the importance of digital safety because we feel that that is where the second line of growth is going to come from.